A report from Circle, the issuer of USD coin, revealed that the number of wallets holding at least $10 worth of the cryptocurrency grew by 59% in 2023, despite the coin losing $20 billion of its circulating supply. The report titled State of the USD Economy attributed the decline to rising interest rates, regulatory crackdowns, bankruptcies and outright fraud in crypto, which led users to withdraw their money from the ecosystem and into traditional markets. However, the report also highlighted the growing acceptance of USDC with over $197 billion minted or burned over the year, acting as a bridge between the digital asset economy and traditional finance. The number of wallets with over $10 worth of USDC in them grew to over 2.7 million, a 59% increase over 2022. Jeremy Allaire, speaking at the World Economic Forum, emphasized the rapid progress in global regulatory developments with governments worldwide shaping digital currency regulations. He predicts the US will take significant steps to protect crypto consumers and provide regulatory clarity. The Clarity for Payment Stable Coins Act, currently under consideration in the House of Representatives, aims to sub subject stable coins to regulatory frameworks similar to traditional financial services. Alaire supports the act and anticipates a favorable environment for its approval in 2024. Alaire and Circle's Chief Strategy Officer Dante Disparte are optimistic about 2024 as a pivotal year for stablecoin regulations in the US. True USD, a stablecoin linked to Justin Sun, has fallen below its $1 peg due to reports of holders cashing out hundreds of millions of TUSD in exchange for competitor Tether. The peg first fell below $0.984 on January 15th and now trades for $0.988, 1.3% below its intended $1 peg. The deep begging event occurred after midnight on January 15th amid a surge of selling on Binance. As of publication, traders have sold over $339.2 million worth of TUSD in the last 24 hours, resulting in a net outflow of $42.3 million. On January 10th, True USD faced issues posting real time attestations of its reserves, suggesting it may have been under collateralized. In the upcoming segment, we will update you about the following news. Clayton and Finchia jointly propose a chain merge to create Asia's leading blockchain ecosystem. Google Cloud joins Flare Network as validator FLR jumps 5%. Binance Thailand crypto exchange open for trading. Stay tuned for more updates.